Now as we're setting up the Oki Pro 8432WT, the first thing that we want to do is remove any blue packing tape that should be wrapped around the printer. So once all that blue packing tape is removed, the next thing we want to do is check our cassette tray to make sure there are no packing materials inside of the tray. So once we've confirmed that, let's close the cassette tray and let's open the multi-purpose tray. As you'll see, the multi-purpose tray has a guide arm here for feeding tabloid paper. To load paper inside the multi-purpose tray, we push this green tab up so that we load our transfer paper in, print side up. When we're ready, drop the gray tab down and that brings the tray into the lock position so it can feed paper into the unit. So now let's go ahead and open the Pro 8432WT. The first thing I want to point out is a warning. Never to touch the black LED print heads with your bare fingertips because oil coming off your fingertips will clog the microscopic holes inside of these LED print heads and it will affect the print quality. So make sure never to touch these print heads with your bare fingertips. You'll notice here we have our cyan, yellow, magenta, and white image drum with these carriers here. So the first thing we're going to do is remove the orange carrier locks from the image drum. So we'll pull this out like so, peel away the orange tape, remove the orange plastic sheeting to activate the drum. Then what I like to do is set the drum back in, push in on this orange tab here to the side, so that we can gently lift the brace away from the image drum. So we'll take that brace, throw it away, and now we can install our cyan toner cartridge into the cyan image drum. Let's shake the toner to the side five to six times to level out the toner layer. Pull away the adhesive tape, bring our toner cartridge in at an angle, slide it so that the arm from the image drum fits inside the toner. Then we're going to take this blue tab and move it into the lock position. We're going to go ahead and repeat these steps for the next three image drums. Again, pull the orange tape and orange sheeting out to activate the image drum. Set the image drum back into its corresponding slot. Pull on the orange tab for the brace. Lift the brace out of the image drum. Take your corresponding toner cartridge, in this case the yellow, shake five to six times to even out the toner layer, remove the protective tape, come down at an angle, slide the toner in so that the toner fits inside the brace. Once the toner is dropped in, push the blue locking mechanism to lock in the toner cartridge. Now that we have our toner cartridges installed into our image drums, let's check the fuser assembly. We're going to pull this blue tab forward to unlock the fuser, pull the fuser out of the unit to make sure that there are no packing braces for the fuser. This fuser looks like it's ready to go right out the box, so we'll just drop the fuser back in its housing. 
move the blue tab down to the lock position, close the top lid. So now that we have the toners and drums activated inside this Pro 8432WT and we've checked the fuser assembly to make sure there's nothing obstructing the fuser, I went ahead and plugged in the unit here. So we're going to hit the power button to fire up the unit. So while the unit's booting up, let's go ahead and load plain paper into the cassette tray so that we can do a demo page check to make sure the unit is operating properly. I'm going to open up the cassette tray, put some plain copy paper in the cassette, shut the cassette tray, and now let's go to the LED menu display and I'll show you the button sequence to press to generate a demo test page. So when your LED display reads ready to print, let's go ahead and print a demo page. We're going to hit the up arrow or menu key to get to a screen that says functions. We're going to hit the down arrow twice to highlight print information. Once that's highlighted, we press the enter key. Again, we're going to hit the down arrow twice to highlight demo page, hit the enter key, when we highlight demo one, hit enter, execute, enter. If you see this graphic generated by your Oki Pro 8432WT, you have a successful demo test page. So now let's move on to installing the driver to your computer. So now that we've successfully printed a demo test page, now we're ready to connect our Oki Pro 8432WT to our computer by installing the print driver. So let me go ahead and jump on my computer and I'll show you the steps involved with loading the driver onto your computer. Now that I'm at my computer, let's go ahead and install the driver for the Oki Pro 8432WT white toner printer. If you have the CD-ROM that came with your printer, go ahead and install that into your computer now. However, if you're using a tablet, here are a few resources where you can obtain the driver. You can visit our website, www.condi.com or ditrans.com. Click on Tech Support. Go to Printer Drivers. Scroll down the page. and click on the Oki Pro 8432WT. Here, you should find a driver for Windows or Mac. You can also go to Oki Data's website, www.okioki.com. Highlight the Support tab under Downloads Click on Drivers and Utilities. Find the link for Textile Transfer Printers. Select the Pro 8432WT. Select your operating system. Scroll down the list, find the appropriate driver, and click on the link to download. Once you've downloaded the driver, double click on the executable. and run the driver installation. Before we get started, one thing to note. Make sure 
that your Oki Pro 8432WT is powered off and the USB cable is disconnected. During the driver installation process, the driver will prompt you when to install the USB cable and power on your unit. But under Select Language, select your language, click OK. The next screen that pops up is the License Agreement. You must agree and accept to the License Agreement to continue the installation process. At this point, it should begin the installation wizard. Click Next. Here, you have the option to do an easy installation for a networked printer, easy installation for a local printer, or to custom install your Oki Pro 8432WT. For demonstration purposes, I'm going to select the Easy Installation Local because I'm connecting with a USB cable. At this point, the driver should begin to load to your computer. Once you receive the prompt from the driver, go ahead and connect your Oki Pro 8432WT to your computer with your USB cable and power on your unit. If you're running a Windows operating system, at this point, Windows plug and play features should start to take over. Once you receive notification that your installation is complete, click Finish. At this point, the driver for the Oki Pro 8432WT should be loaded to your computer. Here, at my Devices and Printers folder, I'll identify the Pro 8432WT, left click to highlight, then right click to set as my default printer. To make sure that my computer and printer are communicating, at this point I can right click, highlight printer properties, Left click, and send a test page to the Oki Pro 8432WT. So as you can see, loading the Oki Pro 8432WT driver is a pretty simple process. What you got to make sure is that you do not connect the computer to the printer with your USB cable until the driver prompts you to do so. But now that we have our USB cable connected and we have our driver loaded, let's make sure that we are communicating properly between computer and printer by going into our printer properties and generating a test page. So I'll go ahead and do that now. And if a test page shoots out of the Oki Pro 8432WT, then we have successfully connected the computer to the printer. If you see that result, you are ready to start making t-shirt transfers. So, let's quickly review the points that you need to know regarding this video setup and installation of the Oki Pro 8432WT. Remember, any blue packing tape or orange plastic inside or around the printer needs to come out of the printer before the printer can operate. You need to plug your toner cartridges into the image drums and then double check your fuser assembly to make sure there's nothing in that fuser assembly. After that, what you need to know is installing your driver, wait for the driver to prompt you to connect the USB cable before you connect and it'll be a simple, easy process. 
So I hope this covered all the points that you need to know to set up and install your Oki Pro 8432 WT printer. But if you have any questions or if you need any additional information, don't hesitate to contact our tech support direct at 1-800-826-6332. You can also call Oki Data Tech Support Direct at 1-800-OKI-DATA. Remember, their tech support department is available 24-7, 365. So either of us would be more than happy to help get your printer up and running. Now make sure to tune in to Condi TV for more videos in our series on the Okie Data Pro 8432WT as we explore how to run transfer paper through this brand new unit. Until then, I'm Doug DeWitt, your t-shirt transfer paper product manager here at Condi Systems. My time is up, and I thank you for yours.